this lesson, we're going to learn the song Lord, I Need You by Chris Tomlin. This was a recent request, and what's cool about the song is that it's a finger-picking song. So you'll learn a pretty cool pattern. I'm capo four using G-shaped chords, which puts us in the key of B. Uh, most of your chords are pretty easy. So here's what it sounds like, and then I'll break it down. So what you want to keep in mind for four finger picking, thumb gets the bass note strings, and then your other fingers get the rest of the strings in order. So pinky on the bottom, ring, middle, and pointer. So that's kind of the territory that your fingers get. So let's talk about the pattern. You have your bass note with your thumb on the low E string, and then your middle finger, which is on the third, will play at the same time. Following that, your, your thumb drops to the A string, and you're going to walk right up the strings. The timing's a little odd on this, so be, pay careful attention to it. There's a slight pause before you get to your middle finger. Immediately after that, your thumb plays again, followed by your ring finger, which is that high note, back to your thumb. Play it again a little slower. So that takes care of your G chord. The next part is um, your thumb still, your thumb just played, but it's going to play again. Uh, that B note, that B note in the chord family, and it's going to hammer on to, to a C2 position. So you hammer on, and then uh, the answer part, the call and answer, the answer part is your pointer finger your index finger getting the D string. And then that shoots you right back to where you were on the G. Doing the same pattern all the way up until the high, high note. And then you have to fill a little time to complete the measure. So what you can do there, let me get up to that point so you can hear it. At this point, you can just alternate with your thumb and your middle finger to complete the measure. So that's just, that's just kind of filler notes. It's not uh, really important what you do there. there. If you want to play some different notes, you can, but um, that's what they're playing on the track. And there you simply repeat it. The intro is just the same thing again. From there, your verse starts. Same thing. So you're just playing the same thing for a G with the hammer on still. Instead of the filler notes I was talking about, you're, you're playing a walking bass line, just that F sharp, you're going from G to D over F sharp. And then the E minor, you can just keep these two guys there, like in a G position, and then use your pointer and middle to create an E minor. Using the same pattern, that's what's great about finger picking patterns. Normally in a song, once you have something going, just keep it going, and your chord shape changes. So you're going from an E minor position to a C2 position without the pointer finger. Now when you get to the C2, it's a little bit different, so let's talk about that. Um, just start with your, your thumb. Don't worry about your other fingers. You're going to kind of progress up and then back. Thumb, index, 
middle back to where you started and then that high note which is your ring finger Same thing back on the verse. Uh, so that'll get you started with the song, get you started with the finger picking pattern. So try to master that first as you get into the song, Lord, I Need You. Oh. 